Wagyu Wai Chu! Hello Internet, I'm Naya from I'm Nihil, and this is my behind the scenes video for our trip to... How do you pronounce this city again? This is gonna be <laughs> the theme of this video. <laughs> it's Wale Wai Chu. Wailu Wai Chu. No. Wale... Let's, let's try this again. <laughs> Wale Wai Chu. Wale... Wale Wai Guai... Wale Guai Chu. Wale Wai Chu. Wa Wailu Guai Chu. Wale... Wale Wai Chu. Wai Chu. Wale Wai Chu. Wale Wai Chu. Oh yeah. <laughs> for Carnival in Argentina. Filming for Teledoce. Are you excited about this trip, Dustin? I'm so excited because I've never been to a Carnival. Even though we've tried twice. We've now. tried twice. On two separate weekends to go to Corrientes for uh, Carnival in Corrientes, Argentina. And both times we went, it got rained out that night. Third time's the charm, except it is supposed to rain tonight. <laughs> and it's all day the next rain, day. Man, so we're going, you know, there's tonight and tomorrow night, and it might end up raining both nights, and we'll, it'll get canceled both nights. That would suck. <laughs> That'd be a wasted trip to go for, like, try to go two nights and then get rained out both nights would kind of suck. But, you know, hopefully keep our fingers crossed that it's not going to rain and that we can enjoy Carnival in Waiyu Waichu. Was that was that correct? Waiyu Waiyu Wai Wai Waichu. Waiyu Waichu. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So follow us on our journey. That is my life of the behind the scenes of Nye Hill going to Waiyu Waichu for a carnival in Argentina. So uh, our ride was supposed to be here like 30 minutes ago, right? We're supposed to be here at like three o'clock. It's like 3:30 now. Yeah. They um they just messaged me. 3:28. We're gonna be 30 minutes late. Well, it's 3.28, so that's 28 minutes late right now. They'll be, they'll be, in, I'm sorry, they're going to be 30 more minutes, they're going to be an hour late. So, we were originally supposed to be here at 3, so we're going on Argentina time, so that means like 4. <laughs> it depends. It depends? If, if the person has a good work ethic, they're, they're usually on time. <laughs> but it's not as common. So you're saying this guy doesn't have a good work ethic that's driving I think us? they do, but I think they just had a hiccup. Oh, okay. I think in general, these people are professional. So like, what happens when they're like, let's meet up and watch this football match. The football match is supposed to start at 3. That's actually a brilliant point that you bring up. <laughs> when it has to do with football, Argentines are never late. Because they know that the sport is going to start at a particular time. So they're always there ready to watch the game. Alright folks, we are now on the car ride here to Wagyu Waichu, right Dustin? Sad exactly. What's up, Say homies? This is Fe. Fe is an Argentinian. Argentinian. He's an Argentinian. Yes. Or is it Argentine? Argentinian. Argentinian. <laughs> no, I think I think you can say Argentine as well, actually. That's what my professor in, in uh, business school, he would say. The Argentine government. Blah, blah, blah. Uh -huh. Anyway. So yeah, this is Fe. He's worked with us on like s oh, no, several, that. several episodes. You can see all the traffic on the road here. Alright folks, we have arrived at Waigu Waichu! Waigu Waichu! I have no idea if I'm pronouncing it correctly or whatever, but... So we are now walking closer to the Hollywood Waigu Waichu sign here. It's like the Hollywood sign, except it's the sign for Waigu Waichu. Here we go. Waigu Waichu. Which camera am I looking yeah. at? I got three cameras filming. Okay, Which one on, am on, I on, looking on. at? Alright, <laughs> All right, so we have arrived now at our hotel. Waigu Waichu. My hotel room here. I got big ass bed. Air conditionado in the corner. Big screen TV. Don't know if I'll actually use that since uh, I don't really understand anything that's on TV here. Mini fridge in the corner. Better try to get some sleep because it's all day tomorrow, all afternoon, all night, all the way to the morning, I guess. So yeah, that's what it is, Carnival. Follow me on my journey. All right, so it's Saturday now, day of the uh, Carnival here in uh, Wagyu Waichu, new day. What's going on, Dustin? What's up, what you're trying to yeah. explain to me? So, so basically, what I was just saying is, so tonight's gonna be fucking awesome because Poncho, our producer over here, was just telling me something really cool. He was saying that basically, like before Carnival starts, there's like this previa, and like the previa is the area where all the people participating in the parade get to hang out. They hang out there before they actually go out to the crowd. So there's like only those people are in there, and people are like half naked. Girls are half naked and they have incredible bodies and they're like got feathers and it's insane. Anyway, we're gonna be hanging out with them for a little bit. And then they're divided into three different floats, three different sort of teams. And so one by one, each team will leave with their float, dance around, uh, be together and then- so, so we basically have like backstage passes for tonight then? Is that what you're saying? Dude, we got by- Poncho has the passes right here. Here they are. Here, look, check it out. Check nice. It out. Hold that, hold that. Backstage, baby. Press passes, because we're press apparently. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's crazy, dude. Yeah. So Poncho just told me he he goes in in Spanish. He goes, no, 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 va a ser zarpado. So in Spanish that means like this shit is gonna be fucking over the top. That's awesome. Backstage press passes. Hanging out with all the performers tonight. It's gonna be awesome. Follow me on my journey. That is my life of being Nihil. You get to hang out backstage with carnival performers. But I, so, so they wrote an article in the yeah, local paper right, about yeah. us coming here? Yeah, this is an article in the local so paper. So what's like a quick translation? No, just basically like these two YouTubers are here. They're here to have fun tonight. Uh, an experiment like inside with the floats. They're gonna be dancing around. Nihil will be putting on uh, the typical lingerie. That, <laughs> that does one, not yeah, say it that. Does. It says Nihil will be putting on the typical lingerie with feathers. That does not uh, really say for that. For a new segment, <laughs> Dos Shankis Sueltos en Argentina on Telenoche. Yeah. Yeah. You ready, buddy? Sounds like fun, but I'm not putting on any lingerie. <laughs> it doesn't actually say that, though, does it? <laughs> Alright, so right now we are on our way to the beach because that's apparently what people do during the day before the carnival starts here at night. And we're going down a really muddy road, so I hope we don't get stuck. Yeah, so when we were partying at the beach, people were like throwing beer on us, so we all smell like beer now. So I should probably go back and get a shower. Of course, since we were at the beach, I took my shoes off, so I should probably put those on before we get back to the hotel. Yeah, I'm too lazy to do that though. All right, so we finished going around at different uh, beaches to go see the party at the beaches, the daytime parties. And now, it's time we're gonna go back to the hotel and rest up and get ready for the real party tonight. Carnival in Wagiwachu, so continue watching my blog of my life. What time's the party starting out tonight, Dustin? We're gonna get there at 10 o'clock tonight. 10 p.m. and it goes till like all night and then it goes until 3 a.m. 10 to 3. So yeah, we're gonna go back. It's like 6 30 now. We're gonna go back, rest up, and come back out at like 10. Alright, so it's night time now. Oh yeah, they colored my eyes this green sparkly color. So uh it's uh getting closer to a 10. You said 10 o'clock when they start the floats or whatever. I don't know, I don't know. It's not, but yeah, I guess it's like a big party. We're about to start here. We're gonna be able to uh or we're gonna go on the float or something and dance with the people or whatever. Is that what we're doing? Yeah, we're gonna go, we're going uh Go out with their float. This is the Mighty Mighty float. So like, we're gonna go on one of the floats and dance with the dancers. And, and the theme is like, and they're gonna, they're gonna dress as penguins or something. The theme is to show how how much pollution there is, and so to like, like that's the theme of this. Just like, look so at, we're look gonna at, be look dirty pollution in the world. So we're gonna be penguins that have been like uh, covered, in oil. covered in oil. Awesome. For good cause. Save the penguins and keep following us on our journey. That is this uh, trip to Carnival and why we watch you. Oh oh oh. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. This is what happens when we go on these trips. I have people and they just blow on us for dead cokes without even asking. Salute. Salute. Another Cheers. thing though, we're gonna be we're gonna be uh we're gonna be going down with everybody. There's 250 of us. And we're gonna go Look at all the people around us it's, here. It's three Woo! blocks. You can, okay, it's kinda of dark. Man. It's three blocks. Five blocks and, and in those three there's five blocks in total. The first three blocks is like when judges. only the people like the judges judge everyone going down there and the biggest thing is it takes us 45 minutes to walk three blocks. To walk it takes 45 minutes? We're gonna dancing. We're gonna dance for 45 minutes straight three blocks. Damn. That's a long time. <laughs> That's a long time. I made it! I made it! That counts! Alright, I have the best basketball player. Yeah, so we just got to, what, what did we do? We got to dance in the carnival parade. Dressed as penguins, covered in oil. So uh, what, what's, what's next on the agenda here? We're done, that's a wrap. Alright folks, so that's the end of my journey. That is my life of the carnival trip in Wagyu Waichu. We had so much fun. We got to go out into the parade and dance as penguins covered in oil slick. Yeah, it was awesome. It's like a once in a lifetime experience. I had so much fun. Just got back. So follow me on the rest of my videos here on this channel. I'm Nihil. Ciao everybody.